Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to convert a PowerPoint to PDF file in mobile. So if you're wondering if it is possible, well, it is possible. Now, the first thing you want to do here is we want to first check our file. So just to give you proof, I want to go to my file manager here. As, as you can see, I have this PPTX or PowerPoint file here. So let's just go ahead and open this one just to give you an example. And here we want to actually convert this one. So let's just go back. So for us to actually convert our PowerPoint into PDF is we'll have to actually install a mobile application for this one. So no worries, this application is actually free. Now here in Google Play, you want to search for the following, which is Microsoft 365. And you want to install the Microsoft 365 Office there. Now it's going to take a few seconds because it's around 100 MP. But once installation is complete, just click on open on it. Now, once you've opened the application, the next thing that you want to do here is you want to click on the create button at the bottom right of your screen. In here, you want to choose PDF. Now in PDF, you want to choose document to PDF. Now in here, you want to locate uh, your file. So since our file is actually under the downloads folder, let's go ahead and click on browse. We want to click on this device. We want to go to download and basically choose our PPT. Now here it's going to say converting to PDF. So let's just wait for this to convert. Now, once the conversion is now complete, the only thing that you need to do here is review it. Now, once you're satisfied, the next thing that we want to do here is we want to save our file. Now, in our file, you want to tap anywhere on your screen here and this section will now appear. So if you want to save this one, you need to click on more. And from here, you need to click on save as. And here you want to choose the location where you want to save this one. So for this example, let's just download this again into downloads. Now here you could change the name if you want to, but we want to retain this one and just click on save. Now we've just successfully saved that one. So let's try locating it. So let's go to file manager. We want to go to our folder view and we want to go to download. Now in here, we should be able to see our PDF file. As you can see right now, that is our PDF file. Now, the only thing that we need to do here is you just need to open this up and your PDF file is now ready. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.